Tumblr, what does this mean? <laughs> Green eggs and room. I saw that, and I shut my laptop, and I walked away for a solid minute. I know, what a waste of a good RAM. So to help me find that image of four cats being held up in front of a brightly colored background, the cats look calm being held, but they each have their own personality. Never mind, I found it. Tag yourself, I'm a grumpy striped one. Their slogan is stronger than Greece. And I was like, okay, yeah, it makes sense for a dish soap. Wait, Ajax was a Greek soldier and renowned for his strength. Ajax is stronger than all of Greece. Someone who worked at Ajax has literally waited 66 years for you to get this. <laughs> Daddy! You have been visited by the chonk of good luck. Good fortune will come to you, but only if you say, Our Lord, coming! This is the cutest tiger I've ever seen. Look how fat he is. I love him. I love him so much. I just traded my neighbor a jar of raw honey for his parakeet's corpse. It is also worth noting that the only reason I have so much raw honey is because I made a dress for a beekeeper's daughter, and that I needed the parakeet bones to make a necklace for a woman who fixed my antique cello, and that I got the cello as a payment for juggling at a child's birthday party. When did my life get this weird? Dude, your life is a fantastic side quest. Throughout your life, people would try to tell you that puns aren't funny. Those people are wrong. Punish them. You mean like... Punish them. <laughs> They're all gonna die. My sense of humor, suggesting kill them as punishment for an extremely disproportionate crime. He stole my eraser. Kill them. Staring at an object that has fallen over for a prolonged amount of time with inordinate disappointment, points at a garbage can. That's me. Zooming really far into someone's face on Snapchat, something minorly inconveniencing happens. God, what did I ever do to you? What are you doing? My best. Shortening words that are already shorter versions of other words. EX. Thank. Congrat. Welk. And... Bees? Top 10 must visit destinations. My bed. 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 And my bed. Is this meant to be a testament to how lazy you are, or are you trying to seduce someone? I can't tell. Both? I'm trying to seduce someone, but I'm too lazy to get out of bed. Hey, girl, come over here and grab my Terry Fultz. Mosquito on my screen hasn't moved in the past five minutes. <clears throat> you idiot bugs, get in this circle. Ugh, there's eighth dimensional super beings doing this shenanigans to me right now. Do 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 do. Hey, guess what? What? Sudden overwhelming sadness, that's what. <laughs> come on, man. Memento Mori Ring, England, late 17th to early 18th century. Dude, you could put, like, a Skittle in there. Uh, yes. Dude, your fly's down. Existence is paid with suffering. This mysterious chicken church is located in the middle of the Indonesian jungle. The abandoned building itself is quite bizarre, but even more bizarre is the fact that there are 12 underground chambers. The world is filled with such wonderful things. And so the Lord doth say... They call me coffee because I grind so fine. They call me coffee because I keep you up past 2 a.m. They call me coffee because I'm really bitter and most people don't like me without changing some aspect of what I am. Oh! In her essay, TikTok, the great philosopher Kesha declared that the party don't start till I walk in, which is clearly meant to convey that any recreational gathering is not truly a party until Kesha herself arrives. <laughs> but what if Kesha were to leave the party for some period of time, only then to walk in again? This paradoxical scenario in which a party must simultaneously already exist and not exist yet is known as Kessler's Quantum Party and has stumped theoretical physicists for decades. If you're wondering why I went with that voice, I kind of looked at his icon and thought, yeah, he probably sounds like this as he writes it. My reasons for doing things. Spite the aesthetic. That's it. When you sneeze in front of your pet and they look like you've just offended their great ancestors. <gasps> Dishonor! Dishonor on your whole family! In any given moment, there's a shark behind you. It might be a thousand miles away, but there is a shark behind you! And that shark is totally behind you. It is supporting you in whatever you do and wants you to succeed. Yeah! Sidon? Are we talking about Sidon? It better be Sidon. He's the only shark man I appreciate. He believed in me when no one else would. <laughs> oh, I feel happy! Hope you enjoyed those five minutes. Oh no!